Hello everyone, and welcome back. My name is Dicart, and this is episode 3 of my Prison Architect Let's Play. So when we ended last time, we had just got these cells built. We got our solitary there. I don't know, is there a different room for... Oh, that's what it is. There's a different room for solitary, so I need to change these. There we go. So now, now the game knows there's a solitary. Alright, look at all that wood I got here. I think if I set up exports, it might export that wood. I'm not sure, though. Um, but we just got our our foreman's office, and we are waiting for him to finish so we can get our uh, janitors to start cleaning this place up, because, wow, it's a mess. Um, but I feel positive with the fact that we have some prisoners here, so we're getting an income. Um though not a big one, but it's something. Um, so we can slowly keep expanding as we go. Um, so I want to build this next group of cells, but I'm actually kind of afraid that I'm going to overdo it money-wise. Eh, I think I'll be all right. Um, so first thing I need to do is actually build a section of wall right there so that I can delete this wall. So this time around, I'm trying to, I'm going to do the wall first, and then the objects, and then the doors last. So the people will still get in and out nice and easy, I think. I don't know. It made sense when I didn't put the walls in, just because they could just walk up and place stuff instead of having to go down a hallway and through a door, but I don't know that that's going to slow me down too much. Once they build those two... Good. Now demolish those. Alright, so got some walls scheduled here. So let's go for our beds here. Um, you know what? Let's wait until they finish those. At least demolishing out that wall. Alright, cell block A. I'm at 40%. Even when I finish this, my capacity is not going to be full, so I'm going to need to build some more over here, I think. Um, not that I have to necessarily... You know, I could build a whole new section of just cells over here if I wanted. That's the nice thing about, one, putting the showers in the rooms with them, and two, pre-building my kitchen and canteen area big enough that if I build a ton of cells... I think I still have the capacity to support them. I don't have to build more canteen stuff and kitchen stuff. Although I need to obviously place objects. But all right, so let's place our beds here and get these get these guys set up. Oh, first things first, go back to my intake. And I think I'm going to set this to all available. Um Oh no. See, that's I don't have 15 spots available. I have one spot available. Um, fill capacity, that's it. Fill to six. That's the one I wanted. Okay. Objects. Actually, rooms. Cells. And then objects. Bed. Drains I want on the outside walls. That means showers on the outside walls. And then toilets. And bookshelves. Bookshelves. Bookshelf. And then doors. And that should do it once they complete building the rooms. 
So that's 12. So maybe I should. It's like trying to decide do I just build another four or five out this side and as one big one? I just don't know. Because then that would. My reasoning is that would then complete my cell block A grant. Um, and then I could start thinking about expanding a little bit more. Uh, ooh, my janitor's done? Yeah, so staff. Janitor. Let's get a couple of you guys going here. Um, I think I want more guards. Um, and let's see what to research. Um, oh, I know I need health and, and psychology for my next grant. Um, so let's do psychology first. And then I can fill that up. My yard's kind of empty right now. I guess I need some uh, pay phones and benches and stuff like that. So let's put a regular bench there so people can chill. Let's do a weights bench. Let's do the weight benches here. And let's do phone booths up here. Okay. So that should be a pretty good yard for him. I've got some more cells going. My capacity's up to nine. That's good. I'm going to go ahead and expand this. I might add... You know what? These are the same size, aren't they? Maybe I'll turn these into regular cells. And then add... Uh, so let's see, there'd be 12, 13, 14. So I actually only need one more. Ooh, I could almost just put it here. No, I don't want to block that off. Hmm, tough choices here. I like having solitary, but I don't know. We'll see. Um, requires an entrance. Well, the entrance is actually going to be the wall being demolished here. Oh, I should have waited on that. Um, I don't want to demolish the wall. Let's see here. Uh, materials. Demolish walls. Oh, I think I took that away. I don't want to demolish those until this is enclosed. I don't want my prisoners to just be able to walk right out. That could have been bad. If that's the way it works. <laughs> Alright. I need to start thinking about visitation. And uh, I obviously I need a medical ward and doctors. Uh, is the psychology? No, not yet. I got a ways to go on that. Um, let's speed things up here, guys. That should be it, right? Get your stuff out of there, guys. So we can that room will complete. There we go. Alright, so let's run our power that direction. Hmm. And then
I want to build my cell. Um, I could just turn this whole thing into more cells. I don't necessarily need to make it small. Let's see here. If I did a 2 by 3 I could actually have cells on top and bottom. Let's plan this out for a second. So one, two, three, here, here, here. Um, oh no, that wouldn't work because this guy would need it here. Yeah, that wouldn't work. Huh. I was wondering, maybe I'd build a single cell just to get the completion on the, this prisoner capacity. Oh, I need to change these to regular cells. I'm going to do that right now before I forget. And then uh, rooms, cells. All right. Oh, I don't need solitary doors, do I? Yeah, you know what? I think it'll still work. Um, so I guess I do need more solitary now. Ooh, maybe I should have left those as solitary and then put multiple cells up here. I should have done that. Um, I can redo it. Let's see. Take the room part off. You are solitary again. And I'll go ahead and leave the shower stuff going in. And then let's plan this. So, bed, shower, toilet, wall. leave one a little bit bigger. So I have more space down here. Um, I almost feel like that's being wasted. I could just make this whole section kind of an odd shaped common room. I don't think there's a... Yeah, just indoors is the only requirement. So it might be silly, but I could throw a common room in there and like a pool table or something. Hmm. But I need to be able to lock these down, so I need to set up another wall and then a double door there. That way I can lock it down if I need to. Alright, I think that's going to work. So let's go here and set up our... Actually, let's do our doors first. Bed. Drain. Shower. Toilet. Um, bookshelf. Oh, that's what I did. I didn't set it up the same way because I didn't put bookshelves in these. Um, it's all right. They can sit there and read while they're on the toilet. This guy's got a little bit more space. All right, go. See, that's why I don't like having these doors here. Lock that door open. Oh, 
All right, I'm at capacity of 12. That's good. And then once these are done, that should put me at 16. I'm liking that. All right, is my psychology done? Yes. All right, so let's make this. i to slow this down for a second. Make this an office. Hire my psychologist. There we go. So I got that guy. And now I want to do my security f next, I think, because I want to be able to unlock uh, patrols. Or, or deployment, that's it. So I can deploy a guard here. Or maybe I'll just do a patrol... And I'll have a guard always here to just unlock that door for everybody. Really, I could just put a main door here and leave that open. Because the prisoners, well, I guess I'd put the main door, well, maybe like right here. Because then prisoners won't be coming through here unless they're being escorted from reception. And that might speed up. Um, no, because then I just need a guard in that door, too. So that doesn't... Well, maybe, maybe it helps me a little bit. Let's do that. And then we put a large jail door. There. And they're almost done with the materials for these cells. Yeah, so I'm going to go ahead and... Um, Finish out the walls. And once those walls are built, I'll label the rooms, and that should be enough to complete our cell block A grant. Oh, I need uh, rooms for my staff to rest. I might have to put that stuff up here. Just hanging out in the yard. Okay, once those walls are done, I'll label the rooms. There we go. Yeah. It's a quick 20 grand. I like that. Let's see. What's another choice? Cell block B. What's this? Capacity to 50. Hmm. Staff room, five guards. Ensure none of your staff are exhausted. That might be one that's not too difficult. Cleaning, groundskeeping, hire a foreman, two janitors, and a gardener. Oh, that's going to be an easy one because all I have to do then is groundskeeping and uh, a gardener. Sweet. Looking good, guys. I'm never done. Uh, I, I mean, granted, I haven't played this too much, but I, I'm not used to uh, doing minimum security. You know what? My power's over half demand, so I'm going to, since I have the money, I'm going to throw in some more capacitors. To make sure I have space for them. Um, gonna need a staff room. I'll eventually, probably, well, I don't know if I'll need an armory or not for minimum security. Yeah, I'm not sure. So, if eight prisoners eat per table. One, two, three, four. Okay, so I'm still got plenty of space for that. I just don't know if cooking wise, you know, how many cookers it takes. Hmm. So far so good though. They're relatively mild mannered. Look like guards just resting sitting there. So I definitely need my staff room. So let's let's get that set up. Um 
I'll just square this off. How's that? And, um... Then I put a staff door here. And for now, they can walk through the storage if they need. Um, exports. Hmm, wonder where... I'm wondering if that wood will go to exports. I don't know if I have to have... If workmen will carry stuff to exports, or if prisoners carry stuff to exports. In which case, if prisoners do, there's no reason to have it out here. Because they couldn't get to it. But, yeah, just for... Just to try it out. Let's throw it right there. Let's see if they start emptying this wood. I think wood's something I would export. I don't think I would use it. Yeah, sale price, 250 I just don't want to get to the point where I... Ooh, there's a notebook page. Meal time, shower time, recreation time. Much too much micromanagement. Call the regime. <laughs> huh. Interesting. Page 12. Okay, so got this room built. Um, oh, carrying wood out. So evidently, that's good. I'll get a little income from that. I need utilities up here. This is going to stay across here. And rooms. So staff room. Let's set our staff room up here. Wide sofa and a drink machine. That we can do. Wide sofa and a drink machine. So that should help. I think that makes them rest better. I got visitors waiting. Right, I still need to do my medical ward and two doctors. Um, groundskeeping, uh, bureaucracy is still 84% 84, 84 on security. <clears throat> well, arresting people are, uh, are at least going to the staff room to rest. That's good, I suppose. Come on, guys, bring in the sofa. Well, still, work, still working on the power. Everybody got so tired, all my workers, because I didn't have a staff room for them to rest in. Oh, and they're getting held up here because the guard's tired. Um, for now, lock that door open. Makes me wonder if I should put a staff door here so that the workers can walk in and out this way without needing the guards to unlock. Maybe I'll do that. Um, today, I purchased um, the PlayStation 4 version of this game. Thought I would, when I'm in the mood to play some console, I, you know, it's a fun game anyway, so I thought I'd try it out. And I'm just going through the story mode stuff, and one of the things I noticed in that, just the very first one where you have to build a, an execution room, all my workers just unlock and open the jail doors on their own. They don't require the guards to come open the door for them like they are here. That's so much better. Um, see, like, look at these guys. They'll just sit there unless I manually open this door. Or a guard comes and unlocks it for them. And I, to me, that seems ridiculous. There they go again. Why should they... I mean, they're workers. They work at the prison. They should be able to get in and out whenever they need. 
I shouldn't have to have a, a guard unlock it every time. Um, so it was strange. I don't know if that's just the console version just allows the workers to go in and out, or because it was that story slash tutorial mode. Ooh. Yeah, you got caught with something, buddy. Ward. Gross indecency. Recent misconduct, none. Huh, he got searched and they didn't find anything? Odd, he must have dumped it in the bin before they could. Anyway, alright, so... We have reached the end of our time for this episode, so if you enjoyed it, please click the like button, and if you haven't subbed yet, click the subscribe button. Take care!